Put them speed. <laughs> nope. I think the problem is that has too much weight at the top. That's a good possibility. Maybe we need to add middle cars for wheels. Or, yeah, that. <laughs> yup. <laughs> 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 Why not? Yeah. Oh, just, just spin. <laughs> I think they're canceling each other out. That's a good possibility, actually. <laughs> Although it was pretty slow to accelerate in the first place. Alright, it's starting to move. Actually, I've got a better plan. Hold on. The well, standard cannons are a lot worse than advanced for this for some reason. Indeed. Alright. Scrapping the back really? of idea. Since this way they're all gonna go at least in the same direction. <laughs> Maybe. Oh god. <laughs> you almost went off the runway. <laughs> it looks kind of pretty. You know, this force needs to be harnessed. Oh my god, Egan. Oh my god. <laughs> no. I have an idea. Put two of them side by side and connect them with pylons. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. I done goofed really hard. Really? Yeah, I didn't do it in the method I wanted to. I accidentally did the wrong side. <laughs> Shoot. But if all else fails, you could do my idea. So they like, they like flies backwards. Oh shoot. <laughs> it does fly backwards. So, looks like it's gonna fly backwards then. <laughs> <laughs> it's not accelerating fast enough though. Yeah, standard cannons are weaker than advanced. I don't know why. <laughs> oh my god, it didn't blow up. It exploded, but it exploded into individual segments, and now those hear. individual segments <laughs> are flying around <laughs> in Five, are you seeing this? Yeah. <laughs> Alex, are you watching? Yeah. <laughs>
getting out to speed. It's really hard though. You should make a keyboard back here. Yeah, that would be helpful. Oh, God. Did you detach the you know what I wheels just did? or did they explode in the room? I detached them. Okay. <laughs> I forgot to disable my keyboard macro while in the space plane hangar, so my space plane just kept rotating. <laughs> And my first code works to put in the right delay timings. <coughs> oh, damn. Oh, oh, oh. oh. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it almost went up. <laughs> oh, God, my, my arm is getting tired from this. <laughs> you should write a macro. It's so much easier. You just press one button and then you watch it fly. Well, what should I use? I have no idea. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Dude, I just used a large fuel tank to weigh my thing down and the moment it exploded, it just like went at mock speed. <laughs> <laughs> I'll both see this thing land on the mun. Ah, uh, no, there's no air in this space. Oh. Oh, fuck yeah! Fuck. Whoa. Oh no! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my god! <laughs> I think I'm getting a hang of how to fly this. <laughs> you, should, you should add more to the end. I mean, those are control servers, so I just have to hold the S in one direction. Except I keep forgetting to do that. You should do, Egan, you should put both your landing gears really close to your center of mass. Oh 
Okay, new plan. This entire contraption goes underneath my uh, my cockpit because the cockpit keeps crashing into the ground. <laughs> gonna keep trying this till I get in the air again. Cause I know it can. <laughs> no, just, you should add like twice as much length to it just to see what happens. Hmm. Alright. It will okay. go at mock speed and explode with ferocious force. <laughs> <laughs> Why is that perfect? <laughs> Alright, I just doubled the length. Let's see yeah, what happens. <laughs> for as much as much as we know, you're uh you were running at minimum length before. This is literally like how a worm moves through the earth. Except we're flying. <laughs> yes. We're Except we're moving through the air. Actually, this thing accelerates really quickly. This is great. Oh, oh wow. Yeah, it does. It also bounces like crazy. I'm already up to like 120 meters. What? <laughs> 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 Alright, this works much better. Dude, you have no freaking idea. What is yours just like super amazing? Ground distance cover, let's see. Mission time, five seconds. <clears throat> Ground distance covered, 837 meters. Highest land speed achieved, 217 meters per second. <laughs> Very nice. What the hell? I hope they never fix this. Oh, this is fantastic. They probably won't. I'm oh, just hey, gonna it's... see how long I can make one. Okay, I know how to put it right now. <laughs> Don't forget the landing gear. Oh, right. How do you fly it? <laughs> Like, just hold W and <laughs> Oh shit, I just lost half. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Alright. So. Oh no, my thing is going off the end of the runway. <laughs> <laughs> this is amazing, though. <laughs> I love it. It's just like a little fin fragment just hanging on the back there. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Now that I know making it longer lets me go faster. <laughs> oh, yes. The answer. You have made to the you have come to the right cool. conclusion. <laughs> It's just a matter of how long one of these you can get off the ground. Well, the one that you can just made it started <laughs> wobbling mid there and snapped in half. Although I'm pretty sure, like at some point, you're gonna reach a level of acceleration where the thing just won't hold together. Oh yeah, for sure. Especially because I made oh, mine like 20 things long. <laughs> <clears throat> oh god. Let's do this. Oh, what the <laughs> oh my god, it's so majestic. <laughs> That's just weird. <laughs> Look at it go, it's like a slinky. It'd be really interesting to make a rover with this kind of uh, propulsion. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got most of it into the air. <laughs> most of it. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha